Jed here to demonstrate how to chat during a session in GoTo with the desktop app. You can send messages to the entire group or only select individuals. I will also show you how to enable chat notifications and download chat messages. I'll use the desktop app for this video, but GoTo can be accessed on the site. I've already signed in as the user Ryan Noble and have started a session. Please be aware that depending on your GoTo solution, you may see different icons here. Any differences, however, will not impact this video. Click the chat icon in the top right corner. Here's where you can chat with others. I'll type a message here. Click the To drop-down list. Before sending the message, I can determine to whom I want it to be sent. Depending on the group attending the session, you can send a message to everyone, the organizers, only the presenter, or a specific individual. Click Send when you want to deliver the message. You'll notice that the Set Message box is green, and the text indicates that it was sent to everyone in the session. Chat messages you send to everyone will be in a green box. Messages sent to everyone by another attendee will be in a gray box. You'll notice that this new message is in a red box, and the text indicates it was sent from Jackson directly to Ryan. Private messages will be in red boxes. You can click Reply Privately to send a message back to the person who sent you a direct message. Keep in mind that your messages will appear here in chronological order. So you'll notice that the response to Jackson appeared after Maria's message since it was the most recent event. While here, let's talk about downloading chat messages. Click the More icon, which looks like three dots stacked on each other. What you see here will depend whether you are accessing GoTo through the desktop app or the web experience. This option is available with both experiences. Once clicked, all current chat messages will be downloaded as a text file. If additional messages are sent after downloading the file, you must repeat the process to include the new content in your downloaded file. The second option is only available for those using the desktop app. When enabled, all chat messages will be downloaded as a single text file after you leave the meeting. For privacy reasons, it will not download any new additions which may be exchanged after you leave the meeting. There is also a way to enable or disable chat notifications. Click the settings icon. Click the session tab. You will see different options here, depending on if you are the organizer or an attendee. Enable this setting to be notified of new chats. Once enabled, if you receive a new chat message when the chat window is closed, you'll see a temporary notification of the new message in the bottom right corner of your screen. That's all there is to chat during a session and go to with the desktop app. Thank you.